deathly silence. Squeaky chair. Wait a few minutes, see if people will hop on in. Hey, hello, it's good to see you. Hello, hello, welcome. I'm doing an early morning. I'm gonna try to, like, um, I'm gonna try to, like, so I have, like, a new schedule. Thank you for the host. It's good to see you as always as ever. Hello. Welcome to the Epic Gamer Zany Gaming Gamering Gaming Time. Game time. Yan, hello, it's good to see you. I'm live? What? That's crazy talk. Wait, really? I'm a gamer? It's when? <laughs> it's good to see you all as ever. We're, we haven't seen the, the Bob Crow household in ages. So, <laughs> I figured, why not? So, um, I, I'll post an announcement about this later. Um, but, I'm gonna try to follow a schedule. I have, I've kind of figured out what schedule I want to follow for the semester. So if you do exclamation point schedule, that's what I'm gonna try to stick to. Try to, I'll update the offline screen too, later today at some point. So, yeah. And so if you look at the schedule, there's two times on Saturdays. So... Or, I mean, Thursdays. So that means this, the morning, and then later in the day whenever RT gets done streaming at that time. So yeah! And then Fridays, when I get done working. And then uh, Saturdays, whenever RT gets done streaming. Two. Oh shoot, I need to be negative six. Wait, stream elements isn't on my... I gotta update stream elements. <laughs> but Nightbot has the right one. Nightbot has the correct one. So yeah. You did a thing? Oh no, what'd you do? What'd you do? You did a thing, oh no. What'd you- What'd you do? I told you, stop breaking your arm. <laughs> That's illegal. Okay. How is the audio? Do I what you're talking about? Hmm. Okay. What the chaos you did. I don't know. You did a thing. You did a thing. Thanks for the posture check. I was actually sitting on my leg. Audio sounds nice. That's good. All good. Can you hear the game audio as well? Is the game audio crisp and delicious as well? Is, it, is the game audio good? Well, I think it is. I think it is. Very tasty audio. Delicious. Game is a bit low. We might be deaf. Okay, I'll turn it up a tiny bit. It's mute right now because I have to pat out. There we go. I turned it up a little, little bit. Is that the better for you? Also, The Sims is kind of quiet sometimes. Like, sometimes there's like no sound except for sound effects. That's better? Perfect. Alright. Now, the Bob household. The Bob Crow household. It's been a while. I haven't played too much in my off time, just like a little bit. Uh, and so... I think her daughter's still a kid, so let me save my points now to unlock Bear Hug. Yeah, those like 10 gifts have expired, unfortunately, so as you'll see in a second here, like, I guess, I'll just, I'll just go to the game. 
Oh yeah. See, now we're at 38 out of 50. You know how the volume changes again? Yeah. So we have Bob Crow here. We have her daughter, Robin. Yeah, pause for check. Oh no. And so let's see what they've been up to. I haven't seen them in ages. So the hearts are in the corner because it's in February. It's Valentine's month. I played a tiny bit last time. Oh, it's prank day! Perfect! Guess what? 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 It's prank day, so she needs to go murder some people. Save so, so save Fortnite stream. Is like I got gifted 18k subs on the stream? That's insane. Oh, it's prank day. You know what that means? She's gotta go murder some people. So, I think our needs are all good. I think so. So let's go murder some people. Because now that she's not pregnant, she can fight people, which is great. Third most active subs, sheesh. So let's go murder some people with our daughter. Let's go. Let's go travel. Can, can I take my daughter? Let's take Sam's with us. Aw, spec. 100 bit. I say how incredible everyone here is. Everyone here is a red and incredible. An epic gamer and incredibly red. No, you. You smell as well. Yeah, let's take Sans with us. And let's take Jim with us. Why not? Oh, yeah, we can take our daughter. And we have a negative with her. Thank you for the. What are those? Five bitter runies? No, you. You smell. Let's take Sans with us. Yeah. Let's murder some people. Let's take these two, because why not? Where should we go to go? Um, it's prank day, so we need to fight some people. Um, wait, no, it's not finding day. Well, we're gonna prank some people anyway. So where are we going? Back, thank you for another five bit of roonies. I have more to know you. No, you. The gym. Okay, let's let's go to the gym. Let's go to like a different world. Let's go here. I live in this world. I'm over here. Wow. Oh wait, there's no gyms over here. Let's go to the desert. Probably more people here. Let's let's beat some people up. She needs to beat some people up. Maybe find some romance, you know. <clears throat> Back, thank you for 135 bitter Here we go. No, not you. No, everyone. No, you. Oh, well, there's Jim. We have a very high love meter with Jim. Is you know, it's bright in Jim's day. There's Sans. Are we enemies with Sans yet? Share prank day spirit. Oh, Jim's just doing some push ups. Hey, you know how it fits to know you? Know you? At buildings near her from the gallery. I should do that. I might do that after she murders some people. Where's your daughter just vibing? Remember Bob Crow? Remember our glorious, beautiful sim that is Bob Crow? Like, look at her. She's beautiful. She's amazing. One bit now, so you're happy. You did a good to a good person. Good friend. Yeah, you are number one now. Wow. You beat up Bomba. <laughs> oh, shoot. She has to go to work. Oh, here we gotta beat someone up. Bob, let's make Sans her enemy. Let's mischief, mischief, mischief. Mischief, mischief, mischief. Instead of Sans from Fortnite. <laughs> oh, no. oh no. We gotta murder Sans. She's gonna prank Sam, <laughs> Sans until she has to go to work. She can troll the forums now. Oh, she's excited. Since this is our enemy in the game, just like in real life, that's right. I like you can get CC or mods. Oh, okay. I don't know how to do that. But I'll look, I'll look at it. I'll look into that at some point. Twingle zips, twingle zips, twingle bow. 
I'm just like bagging on sands. I wonder why Automot held that one. That was weird. I'm just wholesome emotes. <laughs> Can I have her daughter, like, beat up Sans? There's Jim. Can we add him to a mod folder and send- okay. Last time see you nerds, have a lovely day in class. Back, it was good to see you as always. Now where is he going? Oh, did I accidentally send her to daycare? Whoops. Ah, I just sent her to daycare. Bob Crow went to work. She having class, could it be me? Oh no. If you need to go to class, please go to class. Oh, why is she a llama? Oh wait, she's a mascot, that's right. That's right, she's a mascot. Ah. It's midterm. There we go, she's home. Great work today. Why are you sad? Oh, she needs some fun. Here, go, go play. Uh, there should be toys in here. Uh, no? Maybe? No class this week? Ooh! You just came home from school. Okay. I'm doing this for a few hours before I have to go to class. Does she not have any toys? There's some gnomes everywhere. Investigate the gnome. I don't think she has any toys. We'll get you some toys. that up. And now it's deathly silence. Schools are gonna reopen in March, but I would be around so you're on the last and not an exam year or younger year. Oh okay. She's she's sad. Where's Bob Crow? There she is. She's just hanging out. Come back. Fourth year is still an option. Okay. Both girls just washing the boosters. Oh, she says, I don't know. She has shades on. I didn't even notice that. Well, we're gonna exam next year, so school's already open for now. Oh, okay. I don't think she has any toys. Let's get her some toys. Because her fun meter is all the way down. We do have this mysterious third floor, so. Where's she find a toy? Just get her like five million toys. And then release her. So she can do whatever she wants. Yes, I am being lazy and not turning any of these. Except for the bear. Bear cult. The bear cult. Well, we haven't had a stream yet with the bear cult since the emote. You do have your hug emote. The bear cult? 
I know, you're here at the right time. It's good to see a friend. Yeah, we have bear cult, in case you didn't know. We do have a cult. We have one of the best bear cults to ever exist. It's a bear cult. It's a cult about bears. And it's the best thing to ever exist. So it's good to see you, Dino. How you doing, friend? It's good to see you. You're officially number one. <laughs> oh, that's big. Robin Crow deserves all the toys. For our bear cult. Fancy dollhouse. Sheesh. Back in my day. Um. Back in my day. We had. I don't know, I don't know where I was going with that. Julie! It's good to see you! You're alive! Hello! You're just in time for the bear cult. Oh no. What's that fancy dollhouse? It's good to see ya! Now we need like a ladder. Bear cult pog! I found it. It's a bear cult. Perfect time for the bear cult. Oh, we have no lights in this room. We need some lights. We need some lights. There's, there's no lights in this room, unfortunately. Dino, thank you for the sub for two months. You subbed, hooray! Heck yeah, get those bear cult emotes going, gang. For the sub. Heck yeah. Oh. Wait, that brings us up to 39. Hang on. Ooh, 39. Let's go. Let's go. Get some hype in the chat. Heck yeah. Nice, thank you very much, Dino. It's good to see you, as ever. Uh, we don't have any lights in this room. We need all the lights. Every single one. We need every light to ever exist. It's a great day to be at the Bear Cult. That's right, where is that one light I like to use? Where is it? Now this is for her daughter, so we need some fun lights. It's an eerie. Should be good. Throw snowman in here, you know? Oh no. Um, let's see. Oh, there's hanging lights. Well, that's cute. Let's get like 50 of these. Crow's alive? Crow's probably alive. The morning. Crow's nocturnal. Not all crows are nocturnal, but our crow is nocturnal. Mostly. We don't have enough lights. Funny as I made the bear cult mode and I wasn't able to join the stream and the cult originated. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's a lovely emote, Julie. I love it so much. It's adorable. It's so cute. And I love it. It's perfect. Just like you. <laughs> uh, let's see. What are the dark corners we have? We need more light. There's not enough light. Just me and Oma making terrible puns. Yeah, Julie is perfect, in case you didn't know. And the bear chairs, that's right. Uh, I need more light. There's not enough light in this room. There's not enough light in this room. We need more light. There's not enough light in here. We need more light. 
I gotta add a fireball as well. It's too dark. You know, I don't know. Do you guys think we have enough lights? I don't think we have enough lights. We might need more lights. What do you think? I don't think we have enough lights. Oh, and then where's that one light that I like to use? We need to just get like a bunch. Well, that's cool. Oh. Try it open plan. It is an open plan. There are never enough lights. There's not enough lights in here. We might need some more. There it is. We might have... Um, is there any other blank spots? There's one. There's a few here. Make sure Crow, uh, Bob Crow's daughter isn't in darkness. Because Robin Crow is the light of Bob Crow's life. And so she needs enough light to play, you know? I think that's decent enough. We might need more lights, though. I don't know if we, we might need more lights eventually, but for now, that's, that's alright for now. Uh, we need, like, a, a ladder. Let's get, like, let's get a bright yellow one. Is the pen that takes out one of the dinosaurs? That one should be fine. No, wait, no, it needs to go downstairs. Hang on. Uh, probably in the center here would be a good spot. Probably there might be a good spot. You know, it's, it's only nine hours watching streams. Oh no. I hope you're enjoying it. Perfect spot, right in the middle of the room. Definitely not a safety hazard. Definitely not a safety hazard. There we go. Perfect. I think it's perfect. What do you think? There's no windows either, it's just lights. Maybe we need like one window. We need like a one window. Let's get a porthole. Let's get a blue one. Like a few of them. Just the hole they can jump down. Oh no. Well, I mean, who's gonna be playing up here is her toddler. Wait, can toddlers climb up ladders? I don't know if they can. Hang on, I might need stairs actually. I don't know if toddlers can climb up ladders. I don't think they can. I'm gonna have to get some stairs. Hang on. You know, plenty of like windows and lights when she's playing, you know. There's plenty. There. Okay, we'll have that, plus we'll have some stairs. Stairs is not falling, oh no. We'll have some nice, nice stairs. Some fancy stairs. I want to get a different... Oh, look like they're gonna fall down. Get those. Perfect. Oh, what, what was removed? That should be fine. Beautiful. Get some railings for safety. Fine, we'll get some railings for safety. Tellers have to learn how to get up the stairs. Okay. There we go. Perfect. Definitely very safe for a toddler. Clearly, very safe. For the care of them. Oh, okay. Okay, let's see if she can like play with the toy. She can hit things. Oh, okay. It's true. Drop the towel and stop moving. It was so happy from falling and just like, oh, did you? oh no. Seems an hundred percent perfect game. No flaws whatsoever. Oh, she can get up the stairs herself. 
She's getting there. Julie, oh no. <laughs> Julie. No, she's getting there. She's getting there. She'll start to learn how to play. Don't mind then. Just aspire. No, she has a bunch of toys to play with now. All the toys to play with. And now she's happy. She has toys to play with. But then now she's tired. That's okay. It's hard to see her on the sims. Oof. Bob Crow's just... She's still in her work uniform, you know? Um, She's a mascot, as you know. That's just Bob Crow, you know. She's working out, too. That's just an average day for Bob Crow. She is a professional. She's working out, as you know. I right, look out. Like, what's her, like... Her fitness is at four. Jeez. This one has all the pets. Jeez. Her fitness is at four. Jeez. Yeah, she can beat you up. She could murder you. She can murder you. Call me Kevin. Kevin... I think RT got, like, all of them at once. Or at least, like, at the time. But I have pictures. Exactly. She's just having a good time. Like, Bob Crow can literally murder you. Like, look at this fearsome... Fearsome person here. She can literally murder you. Like, she can actually murder you. Look how strong she is. Like, five of them? I don't care. Okay. Let's move to her inventory. Oh. You can murder me if they're strong enough? Oh, she can. <laughs> this is right next to the stairs. The wooden stairs, too. I think that's safe, isn't it? That the tiki torches are right next to the wooden stairs. That's definitely safe, right? That's 100% safe. That's very safe. It's the most safe thing you've ever seen. And then you can always just walk out of here to get to the dining table. See, now this room's finally taking shape. You can see it. Oh no, you good. Oh, she's hungry too. Oh no. Puck, it's good to see you. How spacious feel this house. This house is great. There's Bob Crow. And Robin Crow. She she tired. Let's give her let's give her some chicken nuggies. It's good to see a tuck. We're just vibing with the crow, you know. I'm just having a good time. Oh, she's happy. She's making some chicken nuggies for her daughter. Oh, she angry. Raw Crow is happy. Everyone's happy. Well, her daughter isn't happy. She's tired and hungry. But Bob Crow's going to feed her. Don't worry. That's what she's doing. Also, she walks like a vampire, in case you didn't know. Oh, no. She just went through the wall for a second. Bob Crow is happy. That's all that matters. All that matters. Oh, she fell down. Oh no, is she tired? Don't worry, honey, we'll get you some chicken nuggets. It's only midnight, that's okay. It's also winter. 
That's high bear nation day, that's right. Oh dear leader day is coming up. Oh, that's great to hear. <laughs> Sleep is part of me. She is a toddler, so. She fell down. You know, like hibernate. No sleep just high name. Yeah, dear leaner day's coming up real quick actually. Is a silly trick. <laughs> oh yeah, Kevin had a bear, that's right. I watched from RT's perspective for the rest kingdoms. Calm down after she eats. Bear cult. Oh, well, she can't put the knives. How sad. You go watch your daughter. I'm just vibing to some music, you know. Hugs are good, hugs are very good. Yeah, that was crazy. Oh, Crow, no, you can't sleep yet. You have to pick up your daughter. <laughs> you have to do that, too. Oh, Crow, be a parent. She has to go parent now. I thought I had her a nanny. I think they were successful. We up for nice? <laughs> Love the day. Oh, Crow is now being a parent. Oh yeah, she's a tramp stamp. I forgot about that. Having a fun time. They're bonding. Oh, girl, I know you're tired. You gotta take care of your daughter. Don't put her toys away. They're out for a reason. Oh, she's gotta. Oh yeah, yeah. Put her, put her to bed. No, put, put her to bed. Welcome to the void. We all love the void here. Yeah, it's Dear Leader Day tomorrow. Exciting. Yeah, how y'all doing? Y'all doing good. You had soup today. That's nice. Soup is good. No Chartiste perspective, same. Slight headache, are you doing good? Oh, I hope your headache feels better, Tuck. It's good to see you, though. Yes, the void. We love the void here. Change back into your winter outfit, which is this one. 
Probably just dehydrated. Oh no. Probably. You need to drink some water. Do we need a hydration reminder? Do we need a hydration reminder? Oh, don't worry. That's cute. Solid relationship. Gotta hydrate, hydrate, lads. Gotta do it. Or sleep for it. Or both. Oh no. Hydration, lads. You gotta do it. It's important. The hydrate. You gotta hydrate. It's very important. Oh, she's just doing some dishes. Washing some dishes, you know. Hydration is very important. We need a nap time reward. Are we just like taking naps in chat or something? Girl, where are you going? Where are you going? Yeah, go, go to bed, Bob Crow. Go to bed. Oh, she's saying you're from Eno Radic. Oh, neat. Excellent holiday. That's great to hear. Yeah, girl, it's like four in the morning. Go to bed. They sleeping. Time doesn't exist. Yeah, tomorrow is Deer Leader Day, which is the best day ever. You know. We love Deer Leader Day. Yes, the Deer Leader Day starts tomorrow. We have to decorate. But hibernate. That's coming up. I mean, that's that's on uh, next week. Rebate day. Oh no. Hmm. Interesting. Well, Prince Deer Leader. Do you like bears? Look, we have our high bear, high bear nation day. That's coming up. Don't worry. That's 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 after New Year's. Don't worry. It's right there. That's coming up on Sunday. It's been a week since time. I do like bears. Bears are cool. Hey, Bear Nation Day, but also... But also, Deer Leader Day, though. The Bear Leader. You mean Bob Crow? No, but the Bear Cult is in Sans' house, though, so is Sans the Bear Leader? He might be, you know? Did you think of that? Zoom your grilled cheese. The lore. So it's I think Sans is the is like the bear cult leader. You know. He might be. What do you think? He could be. She's having a fun time. Making some grilled cheese. She's a professional cook as you know she is a professional you gotta bow to the bear we do have a bow command getting chalky milk from the shop nice very nice chalky milk is great to hear it's great to have and to hear you listen to your chalky milk you also have a bow command i believe oh she's just having a good time she's watching tv while having her grilled cheese all is well she's literally just vibing Oh, she has Mondays off. Nice. Vow a moment. I mean, it's on the list of things. Like, I gave Moon actually a list of like emotes that I'm considering. And then she can choose any of them from the list. Yeah. yeah, we get our fifth emote once we meet our um, sub goal. So, yeah. We're 11 away from that now, which is cool. Of course she's watching sports. Of course she's watching sports. I wouldn't expect anything less from Bob Pro. She's watching sports and just vibing. Can't wait for the tuxie heart. It's so cute. It's so cute. My spoilers for her next demo. I mean, y'all knew where I have a tuxie emote next. That's next. Um, 
So yeah, that's- I'm waiting for that to get approved. So, there's a Tuxie Heart made by Squidly. It's adorable. And so... Once that gets approved, you guys can start using it. I don't think it's approved yet. It takes like a couple of days, I think. Spoilers, you're good. <laughs> yeah. It takes like a few days, but yeah. We'll, you guys will all see that. It's very cute. It's adorable. So hopefully in the next couple of days it'll get approved. She's just having a vibe. Hello in here who doesn't know what it looks like. I showed my mods and then I just revealed the name over on Ragtag, so. Oh, that's cute. So most people don't know what it looks like. No, you can take your bath too, don't worry. Fair enough. You get we will, you all see it though. I'll post I'll post about it once it's once the Twitch approves it. So So yeah. Oh no. She's sleeping, they're always vibing. Very tasty dish, that grilled cheese. She's very happy right now. Nice. She's just having a fun time, you know. She's doing flawlessly right now. She's having a great time. Yeah, I don't know indeed. She, of course she's doing sit-ups. <laughs> of course she's doing sit-ups in the bathroom. I don't expect anything less. I'd like to come over and hang out. Sure, why not? Let's get some excitement. Some random guy's gonna come over and hang out, so. Who's this guy? Do we even know him? Apparently we do. Um, some, ran some random guys just at our house now, I don't know. Alright, sacrifice! We do have the basement. <laughs> it's a very- it's just the basement, you know. Let's build a basement dungeon. Sans also has a basement dungeon, as you know. You. Ha ha There we go. Yeah, let's get our basement dungeon. Use this make money. Only bear stuff, that's right. Added to the inventory, but all right. Let's make a basement. Let's make a little basement dungeon. We have our basement dungeon. Don't mind the random standing pools of water. Now, like since we're just going in here, what are you talking about? Now, like in Sans' house. Let's get some, like, normal-looking furniture, you know. Just to, like, you know, just say it's, like, a normal house. You know? It's just a normal house. What are you talking about? Like, there's nothing suspicious going on here. It's just a normal house, guys. Like, what are you talking about? It's just a normal house. There we go. 
just a normal little house, you know? There's nothing suspicious going on. Oh, it's the kitchen. Actually, the trivial and the bear called this Ivy! Yeah? Here we have a kitchen. Uh -huh, a bathroom. Perfect. For our captives. I mean, our friends who are going to inhabit this basement. Uh, let's see. Where should it go? It needs a door. Well, the door's by the sink. Perfect. The basic bare necessities so far. We have a bathroom, we have a kitchen, we have a study. Stretch the kitchen out. Nah, it needs to be tiny. We need a tiny kitchen. I said we need a fancy room. There's a room. It's a nice pink. What's gonna accept like that kind of stuff? Let's see. I might need a mid hallway. Go. There's a bedroom. Well, there's the door. It's on this side. Okay. It's gonna be very annoying. Eh, it's a tiny kitchen. That's how big my kitchen is. I see you're making a basement. My kitchen's tiny. Let's see. The bedroom. It's got like a nice, nice living room going on, you know. Case of company. Perfect. Some light in here, yo. I can attach right to the bedroom. Perfect. I will have to get a hallway though. Because <laughs> this isn't connected. It might be for our captives, you know. It's just a nice, nice little basement area, you know. A holiday earth. Oh, that's nice. Ooh, let's get a nice, like, blue. You know. There we go. Nice, very nice. Yeah, there's a door right there. Perfect. Just lead right into it. And then there's a door out this way. It's for our guests. Exactly, it's for our guests. Of course. That's fine. Yeah, have a nice little dining room area. That one's kind of cute, actually. That one has windows, so they can see into the void. Perfect. Get a nice green going here. It's for our guests. Guests for life, exactly. Those all connect to each other. Still need to connect like this one to that one. So... Let's see. Room to think. Nice, 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 just nice little room. A nice little room to think in, you know. Just put one on the end there. Nice. Very nice. It's not connected to anything. Right, I'll fix that. Let's see here. Uh... Oh, incubator. Incubator. That's an interesting name to have, you know. That's a nice little name. That's a nice name to have. Let's just pop that right there. Perfect. Oh, and that has a that has a door as well. Very nice. I still need to connect like like this area to like the rest of it. I think there's a courtyard as well. Perfect. There's room for like an infant too. Jesse has for some reason to have like an infant in here. Guest room's basement much far. I like your guests. Yeah. Space here, you know. Yeah, that's the outwards. Is that for like toys and stuff? I guess one stop screaming. Ah, oh, you might need to do something about that. I like the obnoxious yellow of it too. Oh, it helps my colors. I like the yellow of it. It's so alright here though. Hmm. 
Mars. Uh, smell like doors. Oh wait, there's a door right there. Perfect. Might need a small hallway right here. <clears throat> you might need a small hallway right here. We'll come back to that. We finished building the basement. You like the screaming columns, you? Oh, that's wonderful to hear, Julie. Is there a playroom? Oh, just like a little room, y'all. Let's get red like the blood of our enemies, you know. Hmm. Where can this go? This might have to go off of like the study. There we go. Perfect. And there's a door going into the kitchen. Perfect. So that connects that half. Very pleasant ambient noise. That's right. Exactly right. Got like a teen idol back in the bedroom. Yeah, it's gonna get a nice color here. Door is on that side. Um, you have enough room for it? You should. Just pop it right next to the other one. Perfect. I'll have to get a little hallway though. Very calming enough. We really only need two, one bedroom, so. Not all of our favorite things, wow. We have to get one of these now. I like the colors in my room. Turns out big. Oh, we have room back here, actually. Hang on. Oh, it fits perfectly right there. Perfect. We have to connect it, though. We have to make sure everything's connecting. Trollsy, it's good to see you! Welcome to our basement dungeon. Or making. Oh, we get outdoor areas too. Oh, that seems small enough. Is this big enough? Yeah. Oh, we don't have enough room though in this house, fortunately. Welcome. Do we have enough room for this? Oh, perfect. We got a little corner here. It's perfect. It perfectly fits right there. Oh, and it's covered in snow immediately. That's awesome. Perfect little snow area. That worked. Gardening haven. We're not a cult, I promise. We got a little entryway too. We got a shed. I'll give them a shed. Oh, they got like oh, flowers though. Where does this fit? Uh, this doesn't really fit much of anywhere. Uh, let's see. Hmm. I'll get rid of like the. There we go. Oops. We are a club. You feel very welcome to the basement. It's a nice basement, you know. It's a very nice basement. I know this actually fits quite nice right here. Almost, almost fits there. Not really. Oh, these are big rooms. Okay. We do need an outdoor area though. Big enough. It's hydration ready, you gotta hydrate or else. It's a nice little room. Almost a perfect fit. But not really. Gotta hydrate. Okay, we'll get the labyrinth. Because every home isn't complete without a labyrinth. As you know. If I can find a spot for it, is it that is. Uh, right here. Perfect spot. Like, every home isn't complete without a labyrinth. As you know. I'll hydrate as well. Perfect. I think 
That's good for all the rooms we need. Now let me build some hall hallways to make sure every room is connected. Uh, let's see, that's not connected to anything. Uh, connect this to... Let's see... Connect that to the study, I guess. Yeah. We'll have to get a door. I'll get a door room right here. Get a nice... Uh, what door do we get here? Get the monster doors. Perfect. Nice little hallway space. Everyone needs a hedge maze. If you don't have a hedge maze in your house, then what are you doing? We gotta decorate this room. Oh, we need some lights in that room, too. Very important. Very important we get some lights in that room. Don't mind that it says bottom of the basement. <clears throat> it's just a normal room, you know. It's a normal room. Nothing suspicious going on here. Where are those little lights? I can never find them. There they are. Get a few lights, you know, others we can't really see. Or waking our way through this house. Because this is clearly a normal house. Well, that's cool how the lighting goes. Well, that's a room, too. No one's ever going to go in there, but that's a room, too. So those are connected. So this is connected to that room. That room's connected to nothing. Okay. Yeah, that's not connected to anything. It's just windows. Okay. And then the hedge maze is connected to this room. And I think that's it. It's just that room in the, the outside. It's like out, kind of outdoorsy space. Right here. Uh, I think this is a whole open area right here. Uh, this room is connected. Is it connected to anything? Oh yeah, it's connected right there. The room is connected to the kitchen, which is connected to this little study area, which is connected to the bathroom. Okay. Or, yeah. This bedroom is connected to this living space, which is connected to the holiday room, which is connected to the dining room, which is connected to nothing else. This room is connected to the playroom, which isn't connected to anything, I think. So we need a little hallway. Or a door. Yeah, we just need a door. Labyrinth in a labyrinth, exactly! Get the... Get the bunnies, they're cute. Oh, there's stuff on the wall we can't then look at. There's room on this wall, though. Okay, so it's actually connected on this wall here. There's actually room for a little hallway here. There we go. They're all connected now. It's almost been an hour. Wow. Crazy, I know. Probably only go another half an hour, 45 minutes. Because um, I have class at noon on Thursdays. And we can eat around like 11 ish. So, in about an hour. So, you have me for about another hour. So, yeah. 
Yeah, I'm gonna try to actually- uh, Julie, you weren't here for the very beginning where I said this, but I'm gonna- I actually have a schedule I'm gonna try to, like, stick to. Um, if you do exclamation point, um, schedule. Night- the one Nightbot says is the one I'm gonna try to stick to. I have to change the one on stream elements. And so, yeah. Oh, Cap, thank you for the follow. It's good to see you. Good to see you, friend. How you doing? Uh, welcome to the basement dungeon. Um, Kip crashes through the ceiling and furiously face plants into chat. Well, hello there. It's good to see it. Do you like our basement dungeon? <laughs> we might have a basement dungeon. Don't, don't mind that. Don't, don't mind the basement dungeon. It's a very, it's very nice and homely, I know. Like the two big bears? Nice! Oh, then you're gonna love our bear cult, uh, Kip. We have a bear cult. Um. <laughs> Look into the, the, the club! Yeah, we have- it's a club. Not a cult. Bear cult hug. That's right, Julie. We might have a bear cult. Don't mind it. Gotta connect these now. Let's see. Connect this to um, let's give it a triangle space. The theme of this house is triangles. The no in the middle of the hedge maze. Yeah, all these are like preset rooms, but it's like it's because it's like a normal space. You know, it's for our friends who will live here against their will forever. It's a great time, you know. Yeah, we have a group hug command, Julie. I added some new commands like. Uh, last stream, I think. A gnome. Yeah, it's a nice little... I mean, what what house isn't complete without a hedge maze? You know? What house isn't complete without it? Is there... Ooh, I can fit a door right there. Perfect. This has been a very long time since played Sims. Oh, I played the original one. Nice, this is the first one I've ever played. And so... It's very fun. I've never played any of the other ones before. Except for this one. It's a unicorn. I can't go there. Oh no. Well, I'll just have to put a second door in the bathroom. We also never saw Kevin's Sim series. Well, we have Jim Pickens in this game, so... Don't tell them! Don't tell them, though. No. I won't. <laughs> Yeah, I had, I had a Jim Pickens, so... He's roaming around the world. Actually, the or the character we're playing with that I made, Bob Crow, you'll see what you'll see what she looks like in a second here. Um, yeah, Her daughter, Robin Crow, uh, may be the child of Jim Pickens. <laughs> because that's what chat demanded. The last time we played. I like these colors. These colors are nice. It's not a room. I thought I made this a room. Oh yeah, Bob Crow, she will murder you. Don't you worry. There we go. That should work, hopefully. Go. Get big muscles. You actually got to know Jim Pickens from the Kami Night videos. It was a very social actor and scared man. Oh no. Ah, he's Jim, you know. He's Jim. Now there's no light in this room, so we need like 50 lights. <laughs> oh no. Ah, that's Jim. Yeah, those are really great. We need just like a few lights in this room, you know, just like a couple. You know, because this room's very dark and dim. So we need just like a few dozen lights, you know. Because we can't have a room without any light. Because clearly this is reality here. Um, uh, and so we have to make this as realistic as humanly possible. At least two, at least two lights, you know. Can't have our, um, our, f our friends that live in this basement. Um, we can't have them living in darkness. Clearly. I think that's connected. It's not connected. 
Can I do it on that side? The door's over there. Our friends, yeah. And I gotta connect this. Don't make it be good, it doesn't destroy the hedge maze. There we go. Oh, I destroyed it a tiny bit. There we go. Still a hedge maze, though. And I gotta destroy that. There we go. Same room now. With a clearly different room. Friends in my basement don't have light. Interesting. Oh, they might need some lights, Julia. Some need light. Some need darkness, you know. Uh, it just depends on what your friends' like needs are. I swear it always keeps happening. People de always DM me like, Oh, Kip, I love your edits for Kevin. You do a great job. Especially those ones on The Sims. Those Best Buy Mile. And so they're like, Well, Sims is the only series I don't edit. Oh, no. You, you only have a flickering neon light. Neon lights are nice. They're nifty. Some nice flip flop holiday lights, you know. Kip. Nice flip flop lights, you know. They really brighten up a room. Oh no, rip Kip. There we go, that's some light in your life. It's not enough light. We need, like, more light, you know. There we go. Now we have some light in here. It's getting pretty dark, you know. I think every room needs a tiny bit more light. What kind of streamer am I, Speech? I've never given that speech before. Oh, have I? I don't know if I have, but... I'm the best kind of streamer. That's right, Julie. Um, so I stream... Um, the, the video games. Of Epic- an Epic Gamer Voice! Perfect timing, Julie. Okay, let me... Let me, let me drink the, the, the water. <clears throat> What's up, Epic Gamer Gang? My name's Amber, and I'm an Epic Gamer just like you. Uh, I stream a, just a variety of games that take my interest and stuff. I've never really played video games before, or never had the opportunity to. And so, I just kind of, now that I got like a PC and stuff, I decided to start streaming. And like, RT inspired me to start streaming. And so, I kind of want to do, like, a variety of games and stuff. <laughs> and so, yeah. Oh, I forgot the time again. That's okay. Is it bad that your epic gamer voice is already my streamer voice? Oh no. This is the epitome of every stream. That's right. This is the high quality content that you can't get anywhere else, you know? And so, just streaming, like, a variety of games and stuff. I also do traditional art. Um, and stuff. We also do presentations here, like, which are crazy cool fun times. Um, I do traditional art and stuff, and so, um, uh, like, painting and, like, sculpture and stuff like that. We also have a very epic zany Discord, if you want to join of your own free will. Uh, we also have a bear cult, you know? Um, so we, we're definitely not a cult, you know? It's very zany, you know? Like, that's absolutely the voice of you to say to them. Hello everyone, welcome, welcome to the stream. Today we're going to be streaming blah blah blah. Zany. That's so zany of you, you know. And so yeah, just like a variety of different games and stuff. And, uh, art sometimes, you know. Just kind of whenever I'm like, feeling like, you know, or like, games that I actually have, you know. You feel like Ever's Hype Woman? That's right, Julie. Yes, you are. Very zany. Some art, you know. I need to give you some innocent sentences to stay with this voice. I really enjoy playing tennis. I've, I've actually tried to play tennis a few times. Um, I'm not very good at it because the racket's very heavy and you don't realize that. I'm very good at Wii tennis though. It's very zany. I know. It's so zany. Whoa, these waves are gnarly, man. Whoa, I've never seen the ocean in my entire life. I'm landlocked. I've flown over the ocean before, but I've never seen one before. I definitely don't have people in my basement. Haha! <laughs> Winky face. 
a tennis pro gamer. I'm sorry, we are professionals here. In case you didn't know, Kip, we are professionals. As you know, we also have a bear cult, and my cat's name is Tuxedo, and he's like the overlord of my channel. And so, this is actually his channel and stuff. And so, he's our overlord, and we all obey him and stuff like that. So, you have to bow to him, or else, you know. There we go. I think that was three minutes. You're welcome. Did you like the epic zany gamer voice? I kind of did an explanation of what I do here. In short, variety gaming stuff, occasionally traditional art and stuff. And we do presentations, which we look like, like there's like a presentation submissions room in the Discord. Um, people just submit presentations that they made as long as they meet Twitch terms of service basically is the only requirement and then i give them on stream and then we just have a fun time you know apart from the epic gamer voice you have a very calm and bright voice thank you i do my best this is what i exist for perfect time for gamer voice julia perfect timing so yeah we're just vibing we're just having a good old time you know uh in case you're wondering what the schedule is um so actually i think i have it down now it might change slightly, but I think I have like a relative idea of what I want. Um, so it would be... Well, if you do exclamation point schedule, it's the Nightbot one. So that would be like... I think I'm going to try for like 8am on Thursdays and like 4pm or whenever. Okay, so part of my schedule is determined when RT streams. Because <laughs> I like to watch his streams, you know? Uh, like I'm always there. I'm always there. <laughs> I'm a regular in his streams, so I like to catch him. Together if his schedule is impossible to stick to so a certain time of day you're in for oh that's great to have you know that's what i try to do you know you know like it's kind of hard to stick to like an official schedule but i like at least i try for at least like once a week you know because i had a schedule before for the past like couple weeks that wasn't really like working and so i kind of like i'm gonna try to stick to this one and i feel like it's gonna work for me you know and that's like Thursday mornings, Thursday afternoons, evenings, Friday evenings, and then like Saturday like afternoons, you know. Because like, I'm a full-time student as well. College student. So I don't really like, it's hard for me to make like, time, you know. Oh, for self-promo? I mean, that should be fine, you know. As long as you're not just like, hey, check me out, you. Yeah. I think we have a self promo room in the Discord too. If you wanna, if you wanna like post there as well. You don't have a sleep schedule anymore. Oh no, it should be fine as long as you're not like spamming the chat with like self -prom promotion, you know. Like every single stream, or, like everyone wants like once in a blue moon, it should be good. You hit the hundred server cap in Discord two months ago. Oh no, I didn't know there's a cap. Oh no. You have to snap a few servers, you know. Like, call me Kevin? Who's that? Like, I'm just kidding. <laughs> like, call me Kevin. More like Bor Ragnarok, am I right, gamers? Because it's jumps your interest. Oh, that makes sense, yeah. We have just a few lights here, you know. Just like a couple, you know. Me wear my cult my Kevin hoodie. <laughs> Who's Kevin? Ah, you went for a bunch of stories. Well, I think I think I kind of like figured, but didn't know. That's cool. Yeah. But for every single streamer that ever exists, do you keep every single streamer? If they stream, you edit for them, right? Every single one, every single streamer to ever exist in all of history. Like if you stream, Kip will edit your videos. <laughs> You say that for a while, people generally call me the Twitch video editor because you can see an edit for everyone. Oh no! I mean, clearly, clearly, who else is gonna edit your videos except Kip? Clearly, there doesn't exist like people out there who also edit. Clearly. Surely you can't be serious. Kip is the only editor. Kip is the only editor out there. Like, 
Well, Kevin's video is coming longer, and edit, or edit have you get slid on your Twitch work, work, your Twitch work down, unfortunately. Oh no. That sucks. Will never drop you once survive. You think? <laughs> I kind of want to like turn my streams into like highlights eventually, but I have to figure out like who I'd want for that, you know? I have like more, I don't know, exposure, it's fine! <laughs> Just pay you an exposure. <laughs> you didn't see any lights I was putting up? Yeah, Julia, I was just putting up a few lights, you know? Just like a couple, you know, because we need all the lights here, you know. We need all the lights. There's not enough lights in this house. This little, like, quote-unquote house area. We need more lights. <laughs> There's not enough lights. We need all of them. It, was, it doesn't matter if they're outside. Do you listen to this one guy? Still gonna be fucking pulling you. Oh no. And if you look down and you see lights. And there's a few lights here, you know, just a couple, you know, just a just a few lights, you know. Just like a few. You look at me and blind it instantly. That's why you never look up, you know? That's why you never open your eyes. So you keep your eyes closed at all times, you know? And you just sit there and you just close your eyes and stare blankly into the void. Um, uh, and you just do uh Bob Crow's bidding, you know. Because that's what you're supposed to do. As you all know from experience, right? I'm trying to sleep. Oh no. Oh no. What, Julie? You never sleep here. How can you sleep when you're clearly you're supposed to, like, I don't know, probably make paintings or something for, you know, Bob Crow to support her? Theoretically sleep. Like, like do you actually sleep? Like, <laughs> sleeping. It's crazy sleeps if you slept I have theoretically hypothetically if you sleep which is which is a little bit illegal sleep is illegal in the basement what? yeah it is illegal in the basement you know like sleeping <laughs> oh you never slept but in theory if you slept so we're gonna theorize what sleeping is actually like like and how do we sleep and like what is sleep also, Kip, if you're still here, we also do, like, we do a lot of philosophical talks about random things, you know? And then I really want to try to do more, like, psychology discussion streams, where we just talk about psychology and stuff. I kind of want to do more sociology, too. In year back, someone DM'd me asking for you to brush out and edit. Something really complicated and spent, like, $50 for that. Told you this project was worth at least 300 not too much to rush. She said it was, like... What do you mean? You pay me $50 for the project edit for me? I'm a big deal! I have 300 YouTube subscribers! She linked him Kevin's video and he said, You're a lost kid! You're the suck anyway. Oh no, hun. Oh no. Got some hugs in the chat for Kip. That sounds terrible. His loss. Oh no. Oh, that sucks. Aw, oh, dude. Dusk, hello! Amber, hi! Hello, it's good to see you. You're Australian, wait, you're catching me out of time. Hello. Doing a daily basis when people expect your nets? Oh no. I'm gonna pay them as I will. After Dusk, hello, it's good to see you. Yeah, so, uh, After Dusk, what we're doing is, I have like, I'm trying out like a little schedule. So if you do exclamation point schedule, I'll post- I'll put this on the offline stream thingy. And then, it should be below the stream too. Um, I'll update it today. So I'm trying for streams over out this time in the morning. For me. And then like in the afternoons. And then, um, uh, Friday and Saturday, like afternoons, evenings. It's like 30 a.m. here, you can't do the sleep, oh no! Hope you get some rest soon, friend. 
Your favorite is I don't have to pay. You just put things behind each other. It's so easy. You want to hire me? Yeah, it's just Photoshop, you know, right? It's just... You just, like, put things right next to each other, you know? I've never edited... I've never tried to edit my life. It looks... It seems so complicated to me. It's a good thing sleeping is illegal in the basement, you know? We're building a basement dungeon. Don't mind it. And the occasional zoom. Whoa! Zoom. Whoa. Crazy. The audacity. Well, there's a panda chair in here. That's cute. Pandas are a type of bear. You know. Fun facts. Fun facts, you know. It's a zany gamer moment. My name is Kevin's random zoom edit. Those were your benches. Nice. Oh, I love that. I love like my name is Kevin, like the zoom one. One of my favorite ones is like um. I forget which Kevin video it was, but like when he says my name is Kevin, it zooms on like RT, like him, like the Steam, like where he's playing a game, like notification, like the corner, like zooms in on that <laughs> because they are the same person. It's just normal and everyday content. What's going on in the basement, Amber? It's just normal everyday content. I uh, just like, you know, we're just gonna invite some friends down here, you, you know, have a fun little time, you know, just having a great time. Trying to recall the video done a lot of Uh, I haven't been able, I've been too busy. So I'm like over a year behind in Kevin's video, so it's like before, um, probably like late summer 2019. <laughs> so it's before that. Just a few lights, you know. Yeah, I'm a bit behind on the videos. That may have coincidentally coinc that may have coincided with um, starting to watch RT's streams. So, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You've seen the playlist of the Kevin Museumist. There's like a lot. He only did like 250 videos in 2019. Easy. <laughs> there you go. I don't remember which one it was. Shit, which one is it? So it would have to be somewhere between. So that one would probably be after. Probably after our team came and collabed the first time. Like after that. Which was in like 2018 and like the fall, I think. So basically, you have about a year to like think about. Technically. So like basically, like the end of 2018 to like most of 2019. It's one of those. I don't remember which one. Like I just thought that was like so funny. <laughs> Because they're the same person, you know. So RT and Kevin are clearly, clearly they're the same person. Clearly they're the same person. Definitely not different people with different lives, you know. You can ask, saw Kevin in 2017 or 2018 and watch an RT video think it was Kevin. That's what usually happens. They're obviously the same person. I actually found RT's content through Kevin. Um, because I was watching Kevin's Plague video. Fitting for the current times, I know. And then RT's video was in recommendations, so I was like, alright, I'll watch this. There's a rumor or not? I know, it's crazy. Who the fuck can't? That's nice. Can't watch YouTube for long anymore because the streamers I watch. Can't have YouTube in the background anymore because now Twitch is screaming everybody or something? Okay. Same. Sometimes. <laughs> Same. Like, I've, I've switched my preferences to, like, streams since then. I don't know what happened. I I can still watch YouTube videos, but like I kind of prefer live streams sometimes, you know. But like only of like, I can only watch like a few people, you know. Like my brain can't like to multiple people, like only like a handful, like three or four, like semi regularly, or like once in a while, you know. Excuse me, like regularly actually, it's only like one or two, but like, yeah. You can watch most streams, but skip through videos. Oh. RT through recommendation front page. Nice. The guys, if Kevin gets less views, at least I'm doing work strong, you might get fired. Oh no. Oh no. Don't worry, we'll just send us a list of all the videos you've ever edited, Kevin. We'll just put them on background on repeat for 7,000 years. Don't worry, I still have to like binge watch and catch up at some point. You have no preference. Doesn't help for some reason how much Twitch on your laptop. Oh no. Something to keep my interest on YouTube anymore. 
I can watch you when I can, a handful of others. Watch the Kevin video. Same brain, you know. We'll just watch Kip's, like, all the videos that Kip's edited of Kevin's. We'll just watch those forever on repeat and in the background. Asma does. Thank you for the resub. Or the sub. I forget. <laughs> I think it's a resub. Maybe. Anyway. Well, thank you for the sub, friend. Thank you very much. A boop. A boop indeed. You genuinely can't look back at the 2017 ones in it. You should the hand sim one that you audition at it. I love that video. I love the hand sim one. That's so good. It's an amazing video. Bear cult, that's right. The bear cult. Your dad uses your account, so it's kind of should rugby call me RD game in mass. Interesting. The zooms are missed times, make no sense. You know, your camera's like, yeah, this one's good, you know? Your power's gone. Oh no, Tug. I hope you get some power back soon. Oh no. Oh, that's not good. What a range. The talent of Kip. Talent. Hope you get your power back soon, Tug. Oh no. Hope you're staying warm and safe. Don't know how cold it is where you're at. I mean, the, like, the Midwest is, like, in the polar vortex, polar vortex right now, so. so. But I know you're, like, in... Somewhere in Europe, so it's hopefully not that bad over there. Hopefully. Granted, you've seen a lot of people say, like, I like the old editing better. It just got worse. Oh no. Yeah, there's like a power outage, like in Texas. Right now, like, it's, it's scary in Texas right now. Like, up here, like, in the more north of the Midwest, like in the Dakotas and stuff, like, we're fine because we're used to this kind of weather, but like Texas, hun, they're suffering right now. Nothing, <laughs> Texas. All editing is good editing because I don't know what the bar is. I know nothing about editing. Talking about editing, you get back to it. Hope you get this one done still today. Sounds good, Kip. Have a lovely day. It was great to see you stop by. And thank you again for the follow. It was good to see you. Watching your early mix with the Sims again? Yeah, you're in the mythical world of Ireland. Does Ireland actually exist? Should we solve that mystery, lads? Just the fuse your back. Okay, that's good. That's good. Bye, Kip. Have a lovely day. Hope to catch you again in another time. We'll have, we'll have to... If you're ever streaming when I am, I'll have to raid you sometime. Um, actually, talk, um, Kip streams. Um, so if you want to do a shout-out to Kip real quick. Check out Kip. Very smelly nerd. Very wholesome. I haven't caught one of his streams yet, but... Yeah. I'm sure the streams are quality. You're underwater right now. Yeah, that's true. Julie's in the ocean. Exactly got false cause Neverland, so no. Netherlands. We exist in like New Zealand, oh no. Does New Zealand actually exist? That's a great question. We have most of the lights we need. No, we can still put some more in here. You don't think so? I mean, the void. The void. I'm gonna shout out to Kip there. Kip does the stream thing sometimes. So yeah, go follow Kip if you want to. I believe he's starting to try and get more confident in streaming, so. Throw some support his way. This feels so bad for the friend of Texas. I saw a massive pile of accident pile up that happened just where the vortex is. It, it's like if the majority of Australia got snatched. Maybe they handled it well, as from my understanding. Oh no. It's in like aren't like Texas and Australia like the same like size, like geographically? Or is Australia bigger? Australia might be bigger. Because like 
Yeah. Also, don't you, aren't you guys having a heat wave down there right now? I've seen some tweets from like an internet friend of mine who's in Australia. Yeah, stay safe, southern US friend of. Stay safe down there. You think you're bigger? I you think Australia's bigger. I think Australia is bigger. Maybe twice the size. Yeah, someone died in carbon monoxide because it left the car in the garage to have heat. Yeah, don't don't have your car on in the garage without the door open, please. Please. That's it's not good. It's a very easy way to get carbon monoxide poisoning. Someone from the Midwest, I can give you a lot of advice about how to deal with winter. Laura, it's good to see you. Hello. Welcome. Uh, do you like our cult house basement? The basement for all of our friends? Uh, we have some lights, you know? It's good to see you. How you doing, friend? Alright, let me get snow and rain for about, in about three days. Ooh. Sun, snow, and rain. That sounds nice. We've had below zero temperatures here for a while. Maybe in Western Australia, Perth, not in East Coast. Oh, okay. Yeah, because it's summer for you guys right now. I think. Oh, yeah. Good to see ya. Australia is about the size of the US, and Z New Zealand is close to the UK, so. Okay. That makes sense, actually. Hi, Flora. Hope you're having a lovely day today. It's great for you to stop by. Um, so, this is the 7,000th time I've said this, but um, I'm starting to stick to a schedule. I'll put this on the offline screen sometime today. Um, so, exclamation point schedule, and the Nightbot one is the one I'm going to try to stick to in the future, so. So, yeah. You're good? I'm glad to hear that. Harlan, it's terrible for overacting with the weather. To be honest, the weather in, like, South Dakota is so bipolar that we're used to, like, craziness out here. Like the weather, like it was below freezing here for like a few days and we're just chilling. And there's a storm while the bread is gone. Because over here in the Midwest, we're just, we just vibe. Like it's below zero, we're fine. Uh, if it's like, if we're in a heat wave, we're fine. Mostly. If it's like an ice storm, we're fine. If it's a flood, we're fine. Mostly. Oh, yeah. Anyway. Not completely fine, but like. Yeah. First, I think it's up to the high 30s this week. I think it's all in Celsius. East Coast. Is it 26 to 16? That sounds like a lot. I only know Fahrenheit, but that sounds like a lot. What's that in Fahrenheit? I don't know Celsius off the top of my head. Same with the Philippines, where two nights in the middle of the day. Yeah. Probably snows here where I live in England. Some places England snow more. I don't care. 30 is hot. Yeah, I think it is. I don't know. Like, what's that in Fahrenheit? Because I'm an American and we learn, like, Fahrenheit here. We learn everything, but the, okay, we do learn about the metric system, but we don't really use it outside of, like, science classes and math classes. Too much. 30 is hot. It's so hot. Oof. Oh yeah, because I was in like RT sub pub on Discord the other day. Like we were talking about like, temperatures and stuff. When your local oh, local beach isn't swim by the ocean for some part for the most part. No. Oops. Oh, I need more lights. Oh, you have different colors. Ooh. Oh, the purple lights here. Ooh. Get some nice purple, you know. Figures like every island is orange. Oh no. I get some fancy purple lighting. Next beach is like 10 hours away. So the oceans here, Midwest, um, this is how big the United States is. Uh, the Atlantic Ocean is about a 23, 22 hour drive from where I'm at. Uh, the Pacific Ocean is about a 26 hour drive from where I'm at. Yeah. It's it's a bit far away. <laughs> it's just a little bit far away. I have 3700 in 98 points. 
I would die. I cannot handle the heat at all. Sheesh. 13 degrees is short weather. That's 13 in Fahrenheit. On your birthday at the end of June 2019, there was a heat wave. You nearly fainted! Probably dehydration, dehydration as well. Oh no. I mean, that could be just heat exhaustion, like... Like, I got heat exhaustion, like, once. And, like, when I was at Nash- when I was in Nashville, like, in 2017. Not good. That wasn't fun at all. Uh, do I have all the spots in this room? I think so. I'm just gonna cover this floor in lights. Are you a viking? I mean, I wear skirts when it's below zero. I have for the past few weeks. Below zero as in Fahrenheit. So like, I think it was like up to like negative 20 wind chill. There's no break in the clouds in the 30 seat. Oh no. You screwed how huge United States is. Screen's probably says California. Not bad. Kind of big, not bad. Dehydration, heat exhaustion, only around 32 Celsius. What's that in Fahrenheit? Because 32 for me is like the, the freezing point of water. Under and commonly? Oh no. It's normal temperature. Ooh. It's over 20 degrees no matter the weather, it's short weather. I could have a word for different color lights. Oh, we have some space above the hedge maze. Oh, but it doesn't show up as because it's snow. Oh. Hmm. It's like 10 degrees. Well, that's right, we could. Make some pixel art, maybe. Okay, let me finish the lights in this room and then we'll. That's all I can need. Uh, I think we got most of this floor covered, actually. Most of it. I do think most of this floor is covered. Um, boards of the lights. Do we have room to make boards of the lights? I think most of this is covered. The only place is like, oh, here's the space. Perfect. Here's the space. Uh. We don't have any room to write words, but what, should, what words should we make? Yeah, there we go. Make <laughs> a good one. Western Sydney is up to a high of 50 to 55 Celsius. That sounds like a lot for last year. 125.6 to 31 Fahrenheit. It's, that's death. <laughs> Sheesh. Wow. Bear. That's a bit bear. Oops. Actually, let's fix our mess. Okay. Could delete that one. That's intense. We're like 30 degrees. Sheesh. I die in the heat. Like I can sort I can handle up to like um I can handle up to like 60 Fahrenheit? Six, 70 Fahrenheit probably is the most I can handle. Potatoes turn out in that. Where I am, it's one of the coolest summers in recent years. We get regular temps up to 30 in winter, even. Huh, interesting. It still sounds very hot. Oh. 
Oh no, we ran out of room. Oh no. We got the PE. Thirty-one. We ran out of room, lads. There's a B-E-A. There's a wall here. There's a wall here. We ran out of room. Oh no. Let's add like a little A here. There we go. Continuing down. Time in my life I had to live in like nearly 40 Celsius. Sheesh. That sounds painful. It's a bit wonky, but there's your b b bear coal. It's a V-E. Half of an A. Another A in an R. There's your bear cult. Because it's man. Twenty one is pretty common in winter too, but the coldest temps we can get to are around like ten Celsius Mary in winter. What's that in Fahrenheit? Cause I don't know. Is that like forty something? In Fahrenheit? It was nine ten Celsius a few days ago. It was up to negative twenty Fahrenheit here for in the past like week or so. You go to Bulgaria where your grandma and mom are from. It's really hot in the summer, you struggle. Winters is freezing and always snows. Here's your bear cult. How do you know I love Irish people to Australia? There's your bear cult. I tried. He isn't there to balance temperatures. Oh, that makes sense. I think we have just a few lights in this floor. Just a couple lights, you know. We just have a few lights, you know. Just like a few. Oh, we don't have stairs to get down here. Hang on. Uh, we need some stairs. Or a ladder. Let's get a nice, nice red one, you know. Uh, let's see. A good place for this would be like. Hang on. Wait, Ireland's on an island? It's not? I thought it was an island. Oh, uh, that's a good place to put the stairs. Let's see. Okay. How are you Oh my god, you can see it. Oh, that's, that's great. You can actually see it. That's funny. You can actually see it. Wait, Ireland exists. Oh, we caught her, like, getting out of the tub. Oh, she's cleaning the tub. Well, she's just hanging out. That's just Bear. That's Bob Crow, in case you didn't know. She's just by there. Oh, I'll probably put the stairs outside. Or the ladder, I mean. This island, Ireland, but the Polar Garden was neighboring to Northern Ireland. Oh, yeah! Yeah. Well, let's see. Um. I think this might work. Maybe. Where does that lead up to? Uh, actually, you're right. I took our stove. I want to put it outside. Will that work? Oh, perfect, right there. But it took away our rocket. That's okay. We can build another rocket. Let's see the lights there. And then the Irish person, your RT and Kevin. Shocking. Go okay, we'll build a room around the stairs. Or this ladder. So no one can get in and out. go. Beckley's very excited. 
Well, they're different variants. Ooh, pretty. I thought it was like silver. That's cool. It's definitely not where the basement is. Definitely not. I guess, ah, I can see tendons. I'm screaming. This is definitely not the basement dungeon. Definitely not the basement dungeon. What are you talking about? There's an innocent shed in the background, you know? Those room doors? I do too. They're so cute. There's also pride feelings in this game. I didn't know that. They actually exist in this game, which is so cool, actually. Uh, well, that's a cursed name. Let's put that in there. There's no lights in this room, though. These are those doors in your game. Nice. There's no lights in this room, though, which is unfortunate, you know. There's an innocent little, like, there's an innocent little shed, you know. Do not have any lights in this. I can't get these colors. It's winter right now. I'm so excited for. Oh, yeah, that song he was releasing. There's no light in this room. Oh, no. I have to turn all these lights on. The blue and purple door. Oh, it's nice. There's the lights. There we go. <laughs> nice and bright in this room. So you can see where you're going, clearly. I don't know if there's enough light in this room, though. There we go. Nice and bright. Just so you can see where you're going. It's great. I love those lights. It's fantastic. I think I have all the meat down there. I did see a trash can. I put one inside, too. Uh, I think there's Sims in there have enough that they need. You shouldn't really need anything else. Maybe a bar? Mm. Ooh, that was just like a tiny bit. There we go. We need more lights now. Get a nice tiki bar. It's not gonna fit. Oh well. Perfect. You love these lights. The entrance to the bright future, that's right. We're spending the rest of your life at a beautiful place. It's the best place you can go to. Get a nice picture of a bunny. You need the floor. Perfect. Oh, I can get them a barbecue actually. Indoor, outdoor barbecue. That's good for the basement dungeon. Yeah, we don't need a roof. Perfect. Can she get here, or is it like? Emptiness. Oh, I think she can walk there, maybe. Let's just boop this over. Nice little backyard shed. Perfect. This house is clearly so and it's an interesting house, you know. It's a perfect little house. I need a little trail. Nice cobbles, you know. We can't see this is spring, but that's okay. Perfect. I think I can fly over the void. Oh no. You like our house? Is it, is it perfect? It's a great area. Beautiful. Let's go into my phone. Let's explore the basement now. Now, who's this guy? Let's, let's say hello. 
Okay, he's behind me. Let's ask him to come to our basement. We have our first uh, friend to live down there. Yeah, she walks like a vampire. Yeah. Crow, where are you going? Why are you talking to him over there? <laughs> what is that? Red spiders. That's Bob Crow. She's our sim. We love her dearly. She is great. She's a beauty, I know. Isn't she perfect, you know? She's very normal looking, clearly. She's also an athlete, and she will murder you. She is very strong. There she is. Look how tiny her eyes are. She's just waving, you know. Chat designed her, by the way. Chat chose her appearance. So her name is Bob Crow. And this is our sim. You know, they're talking about, like, this, like, who's this guy? Like, he's so normal looking this morning. She's perfect. That's her daughter over there sleeping. Who's the daughter of Jim Pickens, by the way. Okay, let's, uh... So blurst. Where are you going? Are you leaving already? Hey, you can't leave. Hey, come back here. Hey, come back here. I want to show you the basement. Come back. Where are you going? Come back. We gotta show you the basement. This seems too far away. Oh no, we'll have to get him another time. So blurst. Oh, we'll have to steal him another time. I mean, what? Eh, she's just gonna make some coffee. I have a nice bath. She's just having a good time. She has her coffee. It's poor quality coffee, but she has her coffee. Her daughter is fast asleep. And so, yeah. Mm, big stretches. I haven't played this in a while. Um. She's just gonna have her coffee in the tub, as you do, as like a normal person does. Clearly. So, okay. Well, it's just about 11 in my time. And so I should eat something and then leave to go to class. And so yeah, we'll wrap it up for here today. Uh, as Bob Pro has some fun, you know. Great to see Bob Crow again. She was having a good time. <laughs> Kevin's pretty strange trying to denude him. You're so confused. Oh, wait, he's back! Wait, he's back! I don't have any groups. I need to make a cult group. Drink beer and hot cider in the tub before. I mean, it's just a good time, you know. Why is he not on the computer? We'll bring him to the... We'll bring him to the, uh... The cult next time. So, yeah. She's just hanging out, you know. She's embarrassed now. Alright, so on that note, we'll call it for today. Let me get the credits level. So hydration, hydrate or else. Let me grab those credits, because I am a professional streamer, as you know. Clearly, I am a professional streamer. Clearly. Oh, there's a bowl, I didn't even notice. Coffee, tea, chalky milk, obviously chalky milk. Clearly that's the best option. Um, so yeah, well, stopping by the stream tonight. I will pause it so they don't like do crazy stuff when we're gone. So, uh, so yeah, clearly we're professionals. We're very much professionals here. 
all very, very much for stopping by the stream tonight. I hope you all have a lovely day today. Uh, let me get the credits because I'm clearly a professional streamer. It'll come for your kneecaps. You don't hydrate, that's right. Just gonna test all the credits, make sure they're all beautiful and perfect. Yes, there's the test roll. Nightball will come for your kneecaps, that's true. Okay, cool. We'll roll those credits. Well, look at Presby zooming today. Well, thank you for Kip for following today. And thank you for Dino and Afro for their subs slash resubs. Come back in the stream ends! I'm just, it's, it's, I have to go to class in like an hour, so. <laughs> so yeah. Love them again for funsies. Streamies. Yeah. Keep streaming, have a lovely day. Have a wonderful night, everyone. Hope you all have a fantastic day today. And so yeah. Uh, I don't know who's going at the moment. Wait, wait, wait. You guys were talking about Kevin earlier. Should I raid Kevin? <laughs> should, should we raid Kevin's uh, offline chat? Bring your class, thank you. Should, should we do that? Should we do that? I kind of want to do that now. Do the end screen. Yes, should we do that? Oh my gosh, yes, let's go. Let's do it. Yes, okay, let's raid. Is it just like, it's Kevin. Obviously. He has to call me. Cool. And then if Kevin's streaming later, say hi to Kevin. If Kevin sees it, you're like, Amber, what? <laughs> okay. We'll read Kevin's offline chat. <laughs> let's, let's go. Let's, let's raid Kevin's offline chat. Send some bears his way, you know. Offline raid pog. Send some love to, to Kevin's chat, you know. I won't stick around for very long. I'll stay around for like a tiny bit, but like, yeah. Offline raid pog. Yeah, send, send some bear hugs Kevin's way. Hope you all have a lovely, lovely day. It's great seeing you as always. Hope you all have a fantastic day. I'm terrible at outros. Yeah. Throw some bear hugs in Kevin's way. Yeah, hope you all have a lovely day. And I'll see you later today at some point once RT's done streaming. I don't know if Kevin streams today. So yeah. So yeah. So twice on Thursdays in the morning. So about now, and then later in the day once RT's done streaming, like sometime this afternoon or evening. I think RT's doing Fable today and I'm ecstatic for that. So I yeah. hope you all have a lovely, lovely day today, and I will see you later today, and then tomorrow, and then Saturday. So yeah, bye!